Stakeholders in the aviation sector in Nigeria have converged on this hall for the National Aviation Conference, organized by the Federal Airports Authority of Nigeria, which aims at advancing the frontiers of possibilities for safe, secure, and profitable air transport. The conference is also to discuss the state of the aviation industry in Nigeria, particularly the prospects and challenges of the air transport industry, which, according to the Director General of FAN, has been impacted by the COVID-19 pandemic. As of 2021, it was reported that Nigeria lost about $2.5 billion in MRO investments outside Nigeria in neighboring countries. Having such investments here will have created more employment opportunities for Nigeria, for revenue generation and training of technical personnel for the maintenance of aircraft. Statistics by the Nigerian Civil Aviation Authority shows there are 20 airports in Nigeria with 23 active domestic airlines, 22 foreign carriers and 554 licensed pilots. The Minister of Aviation, Mr. Adi Sirika, says the aviation sector in Nigeria is a gold mine with potentials waiting to be explored. The roadmap being implemented by this government is such that every single airport will be owned and run by the private sector for more efficiency and of course value for money. Speakers at the event, including Nigeria's first pilot, Captain Bob Ace, also call for synergy among the industry players. Management of aviation is getting more sophisticated by the day. The development of a document like the roadmap to chart the course is an inevitable tool for success. The four-day conference will also feature discussions on the opportunities for investments in the various airports in Nigeria. The COVID-19 pandemic has impacted different aspects of human endeavors, including the aviation sector. Stakeholders at this conference are optimistic that the solutions that will be proffered at the end of the conference will go a long way in helping the industry to rebound. Emperor Simon, Channels Television News.